just like you know, Jake and Natiri, the, the parallels between your lives and their lives are actually pretty, was, it was moving to me. Yeah. And I wondered if that, did that enter your head at all, your parallels with the two of them? Oh, for sure. For sure. I was, I was, um, I felt so linked to her. Uh, in the first movie, there was this fearlessness that I could relate to and this sense of like, just, she's, she's you know, Natiri's a rebel a misfit she's the daughter of the Oloektan and and and, and um and the Tzahik, which is you know the king and queen of her clan and she wants no part of it she just wants to live her life day by day in the forest and hunt and be and be just herself and uh that was very much me <laughs> all these years later I, I felt like a portal of just like love and hormones and feelings and, you know, were just invading my life as my, as my family was, you know, coming together. And so was Neytiri's. Um, the, the sensation that shocked me to the core uh, was fear. Mm. That fearlessness literally went to the other extreme of those sleepless nights, creating these hypothetical scenarios, these unimaginable events that can take away the the, the reason as to why I'm here finally. Um, and and Natiri was no different. And then when I looked into Sam's eyes, <laughs> it was there too. This there, there was just and there was this vulnerability that that I felt in Sam. Yeah. I'm a method that, actor, that man. I, I, I had kids for the before. part. You know what I mean? <laughs> and, and, and I guess he I sensed it. So I knew Zoe would need that kind of commitment. So I, uh, you I were such got busy a with sap. it. You, know? you were like this beautiful sap of like hypothetical scenarios as well. And and then <laughs> and and you brought that to Jake. Jake was just this stubborn thing, you know, that, that when I when I met him and so was Sam for Natiri and for me and then Coming back around, we were afraid of everything. And that's what Jake and Natiri are going through. You know, they're shocked every every day. They have to make these sudden, you know, decisions. And they're heartbroken. But they have to stay together. And they're so vulnerable. And they're so I insecure about what the what ifs. But as long as they stick together, they're going to they're gonna do it. There's no, there's no other alternative. So... You know, it just felt really great to be living these parallel lives, not just with Jake and Nate, but with Sam as well.